tasks that come right. with park rep um, as you as you move along. Um, and so, okay, let's let the trailer run again, and we can talk about a couple things in specific. Cool. So you talked about the seasonal stuff, right? Like yep. you start with his trees, and then, then we also saw the pro am as well. What's that? Yeah, the pro am that really caught my eye as well. Like it's kind of like a three v three or like oh, a park yeah. style. That yeah. was huge, dude. Like yeah, real yeah. three pro am. The tough thing about pro am is getting squads of five together, right? So now yeah, you don't need it. You can do uh, you can do your threes. Yeah, I was gonna ask you: is the squad of five still optional, or is yeah, it just? Yeah, yeah. Some... You can still okay, do cool. five. You can still do fives, but we're also allowing you to do threes. Okay, and um, what about the tournaments? Do you know if there's going to be any pro am tournaments this year that's coming up? Oh, are you are you talking about like uh, cash prize? Like we've yeah, like cash stuff. prizes and stuff like uh, that. We haven't announced anything about tournaments yet, but we are planning uh, a variety of tournaments in different modes. So okay. more news to that uh, to come. Actually, something got leaked about one one of those tournaments, um, but we'll obviously be confirming all the tournaments. I'm actually really excited. You know, obviously the league. Um, led to a lot more competitive gaming, but like there, we're really doing a lot of stuff in terms of like, if you're really good at the game, you can enter these tournaments and win. We're gonna have a lot of that this yeah. year, so I think people nice. are gonna like that. Uh, you guys see Halloween scarecrows and a witch flying over. I wonder what people are gonna think that means. There's a yep. Christmas tree with the Christmas presents, obviously the snow. Um, are we i mean seasonal is one thing but like holiday is another thing right like, yeah it's another thing yeah i'm i'm actually glad you guys um added that feature to the motive it kind of gets us all in the spirit you know what i mean yeah and when everybody when christmas does come and when halloween does come then everybody's actually gonna feel that spirit inside the game so i feel like that was really dope that you guys added that yeah i, I mean people obviously are talking about how the square is pretty similar to last year the thing about the square that's great though is uh, unlike 2K18 where we made you walk into like like Neptune to get anywhere mm -hmm. you walk in a very condensed area and we can build on that area and that's why you know you see a lot of uh, variations a lot of events a lot of that stuff there's new right. shops there's new uh, there's just a lot of new things going on um, obviously the square thing was a good foundational piece like I actually mm -hmm. I mean I, I think that people should be really happy that it's it's a, still kind of a square because it keeps everybody kind of in one area in the same one yeah yeah because yeah. that was a problem sure. at 18 like man f everyone was like everywhere splitting, splitting people everywhere yeah it was kind of hard to get games but and then um, same same thing same thing with affiliations right like if you if you do affiliations you're splitting people i've been talking about that for months that's true. like yeah, if, yeah, yeah. You, if you have affiliations you're separating you're people, people up. into mm -hmm. different into different uh, instances of the neighborhood, and that's that's not good. So yeah, I think the most exciting thing about this trailer is that the park rep is coming back. I think that was the more, the, I think that was the exclamation point on this trailer yeah. is that everybody was really excited to um so what, to know what that kind park of, rep. What were your favorite rewards, either that you saw this year or in when we had park oh, rep a few years ago? Um, my favorite rewards all time. I have to say the tiger. Tiger was the probably tiger. The Tiger in 2K16, I feel like that was probably the best award you guys ever came up with. <laughs> like, and it's, the fact that it was a shocker too, and that people didn't really know about it, that's what made it even like better because it was something that caught everybody's eye last minute. You know what I mean? Yeah. We, as uh, well as the jetpacks too. Well, you know for sure we're gonna have some surprises up our sleeve once you get to that uh, yep. legend status. All the obviously elite superstar. There's yeah. things that, well, I, so I was watching the trailer just now, and I guess it's not as zoomed in as I, it's a little bit more zoomed in than I thought, so people probably don't know all of the rewards that are coming at each level, and we'll probably, maybe we'll release that individually uh, later, but I mean, obviously, taking, you know, going shirtless in, in the neighborhood, some of your favorites are still in there, uh, there's yeah. new park badges that are in there that um, are, are going to get everybody excited. And then there's a whole bunch of other stuff that's like super crazy that is new and um, yeah. And then you mentioned like the car and the pyramid the vehicles. and like yep. crazy things like that. There's just a whole lot more going on. I was actually going to ask you, um, the park community actually wanted me to ask you: Is yes. there any information on park leaderboards? Because you know some people they kind of miss that first, second, and third, and who's in first and 
stuff like that. Do you do you know any information about that? Yeah, we're going to be doing a lot more in terms of communicating who's dominating in the park. You know, one okay. thing that I'm surprised people didn't ask, and I forgot to ask today, was, do you know your win streaks? Like, uh, oh yeah, that's yeah. one thing that I I need to actually uh, get clarity on because. That was a big one, and it really annoyed everyone, including me. Like if, you're, if you're on a big win streak, unless you're asking somebody in your instance, you don't know. Sophie, stop yeah. asking it. So, and then, you know, this, we've stepped up some of these other things that some people like, which is uh, dodgeball. Now it's dodgeball rodeo, which is, which is pretty cool. There's frisbee golf and all of that stuff. Mm-hmm. There's a really quick um, beats clip which you know what could that mean going forward yeah um, um yeah i was actually gonna ask you as well the basketball gods that's one thing that kind of stuck out on the park trailer what 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 is what's that what's that about yeah we are doing a lot more events that reward people that are playing those events fully and and winning like this right. is all about winning um you know even that road to 99 thing replacing that by you know getting to 95 relatively quickly and then kind of balancing between 95 and 99 based on how well you play in the park in career etc that's what it's all about right like we want to reward those people who are playing but uh, a lot but also playing very well yeah. um, and i you know you can't wait i can't wait for uh park rep boost events right like we, mm-hmm. we used to do 2x and 3x and whatever events so right we have a lot of cool ideas and events that are coming to that that i think people are going to be stoked about mascots are back that mm-hmm. was huge what about this oh. uh what did you think about the um the big head thing so it's right the big top challenge yeah um honestly i feel like that's those, that's one of those game modes i'm just gonna have to experience yeah. and uh kind of figure out myself when i saw it uh, like in the trailer at first glance i didn't really know what it was about but yeah. it kind of looked cool but I was just thinking, like, yo, it's one of those things that I definitely have to try. You know what I mean? It's kind of funny because the way you get that big head is kind of hilarious. And then uh, yeah. you're out there and you're playing, you know, big head basketball. There's the basketball gods thing that you mentioned. All these events are going to be about new ways to climb to the top of that experience. And then, um, you know, trying to win all those badges like core conqueror and things we've had in the past but there's a lot more of those this year yeah i also see that gold rush is back in the game which is stage basically yep and um i was actually going to ask you do you know if stage affects your record this year and does that also count towards your park rep uh stage uh does uh i'm pretty sure it counts towards your park rep okay. since it's now pulled into an event right um yeah yeah we need to I'm, I'm so today when the trailer dropped obviously we weren't expecting it to drop today we were expecting it to drop tomorrow tomorrow right we were going to be collecting feedback so we ha- haven't had a chance to, to do that obviously we know the big ones that you guys have but these questions that mario's asking are all good ones and um i, I want to get clarity on all of that and then you know i'll probably broadcast again later this week with a lot of these um questions answer i can answer them um now yeah, that so the out, we can we can answer a lot more stuff yeah um about the about the custom pie charts um you yeah. were mentioning that earlier in i think your last stream yeah do you know how that's actually going to work out as far as like restrictions because you clearly can't make a player that's like all everything like high up you know what i mean yeah so no, do you no, know how no that demigods right yeah, yeah, yeah do you know how that will actually work when the full game actually releases yeah, um, we are. It's a little bit more custom than it is in the demo. The demo okay. isn't really the perfect one to one of what it's going to be in the game. It, mm-hmm. Like, I was surprised when I played the demo one thing, which was like you pick your pie, you pick your agility, speed, strength, you build your physical attributes, then you right. build your potential ratings, and then it tells you what build you are and and uh, like what player you're like. That's not the order it is in the, in the game. full game. Mm-hmm. So I, and especially you know with the whole respecking thing and everything, um, uh, you know, like that's that's vastly different in two K twenty. Now I'm not saying that there's a, a million archetypes. We've been very honest and said there's a hundred archetypes, mm-hmm. um, but you know that you know w- there'll be a lot more customization than there was in the demo for sure. Okay. Okay. Cool. 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 Sweet. Um, 
Looking as far at as the, the... looking at the trailer today, Mario, what what are you like most looking forward to like playing? Um, honestly, I want to experience the three v three pro am. I want to know. I want to know how that works, and um, I also want to know if there's if the you, streets too. It's like yeah, I want to know if you guys have like some some type of maybe a award if you play it, or maybe if it's like a a tournament or something that I know you guys have something in store in, in store for it. So I definitely want to try it out and uh, experience it for sure. That's There's pro am counter to park rep too. It should right. What's that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pro am. Yeah. That's for sure. Okay, cool. Three on three, um, pro am, I think is is a is a massive game changer. It's just gonna allow people to play it a lot more, and it's hard to get five together and three on three. But it's still gonna be. It's not gonna be like the park, meaning right. it's not like like you can go squat up and play a little bit looser arc, not arcadey, but a little bit a little bit looser game out on the on the park. In pro am, it's it's tight. It's you know we're trying to make that competitive and serious, so. Yeah. Um, you know, if you want, I think this is what people have wanted for a long time. Like the ability to, it's a three man squad, but yeah. it's, it's competitive basketball. Yeah, it's right? very competitive. Is there private matchmaking in that mode as well? Do you know? Oh, so against, uh, like your squad or your threesome versus. Yeah. Like match? practice. Yeah. 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 I, I, that's, uh, it's the same question you asked me earlier. I'm, I'm not, I'm not a hundred percent sure. I need to find okay. out. I want to write these questions down so I can. <laughs> I'm gonna write them down now. Yeah, so it was the um, the private matchmaking. Um, what else was it? The... Yeah, what was the other question you had? I forgot them. actually. Let me see because I think I wrote them down. <laughs> yeah, you wrote them down. And then uh, I'm obviously reading the chat, and there's um, there's gonna be questions there. Feel free to. Ask the questions, uh, especially about oh, things like that. The, the other one was is rec matchmaking. Rec matchmaking. Yeah, it's well, rec matchmaking. It's both rec and uh, and uh, three on three program. Yeah. Oh yeah, are they both matchmaking? That'd yeah, be interesting. That's as well. the same question. There was another yeah. question you had too. Uh, people are asking about. We t I talked about small forwards in my last stream. We are aware of that like we're gonna. Um, that's easily nerfable, so we're t we took a lot of feedback from the demo, and we're going to be obviously adjusting that kind of stuff. Because I don't know about you, did you build any small forwards in the demo? I did not. I'm a point guard fan. <laughs> yeah, I got you. So. Well, the small forwards, it was a little bit of a struggle. Like, especially the mo the sh the taller you made them, the worse they got. Like, which oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That should only be for like guards, not yeah. really. Yeah. So yeah. we'll we'll be looking at that for sure. Someone asked, "How long does it take to get the highest rep?" I mean, that's the real grind this year, right? Like that's right. that's what you're really going for. It's a lot like how it used to be in '17, right? Like and and previous years, you got to put in a lot of hours, and but you get rewarded heavily on on that. So people wanted park rep back, and uh, I'm glad to say that it is back. Yeah. Someone else asked about mascots. Is the are the heights fixed on mascots? Uh, the, yeah, um, that's what I wanted to ask. Mascot height. Um, I remember they were shorter before. So we'll get back to you on the mascot height. What else are we asking about? So when I asked the double rep weekends. There is double rep weekend, right? I'm sure I'm you guys sure, have that. Well, double rep weekend. Do, yeah, well, I'm, I'm sure we're gonna do a lot of yeah. Like, Double, double yeah. reps, tri you know, triple reps, but it'll be based on something. And you'll also get rewarded more for event-based stuff. Like we talked about, uh, I don't want to get into specific events, but there's a few that like you have an opportunity within the event to up your own double, triple, quadruple. Like So yeah. I think it's going to be really interesting. The more you win the, 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 in certain events, the more your uh, double ratio goes up. Um, just just for confirmation, because everybody keeps asking, there's no affiliations, correct? No, I, I said that earlier. So affiliations divide the park. So yeah, there that wasn't something that we wanted to do uh, in this year's game. We couldn't okay. do it. Um, let me said, see. Who cares if the parks have divided? The the thing is like. That was something we learned from 2K18, right? Like, people <laughs> walking around in these massive neighborhoods where it wasn't yep. in these condensed things. You can't find anybody. It's kind you of... You barely get into games, yeah. And and uh, so we 
this, the important thing is building a foundation within that town square. And then obviously, you know, the design differences that we had this year and the new events and all of that stuff, we're building on a foundation. It's cool because we can continue to kind of build and evolve that. Oh, uh, someone else also wanted me to ask you, you said in your previous streams that you could completely respect your whole my player. What does that mean? Are you allowed to talk about that yet? Completely um, take your my player and start him over as a new position you build and not give up VC to do so. Oh, nice. Which is nice. nice. Did you hear the, yeah, other thing, the, other, the other big news that I mentioned really quickly in my stream last time was... Um, clothes are transferable between mm -hmm. all the players. So that, now, is, that is Park Rep transferable as well? Yeah, that was something I meant to ask. Let me okay, find cool. out. Park. I, be, I believe so, but I don't want to be wrong, which is why I write all this stuff down. Sweet. So you can only, um, so really you don't have to spend BC on multiple players now. You can just really make one. You, uh, correct. And uh, I mean, people, you know, that hate spending VC, that's a massive thing for, for them. Um, we talked about, I talked about delaying in my last broadcast. Uh, it's something that the team is, is like knocking out certain causes for it. Mm -hmm. so they ha definitely have eliminated some, but I don't want to say they've eliminated all because until the game is live in the wild, I mean, people figure out new ways to glitch and delay our game every single year. So yeah, and, and that doesn't go for our game; that goes for every every video every game, game on the planet. Yeah. Um, uh, you mentioned that clothes are transferable through all players. If you win like a, a tournament event, does that get transferred to all players too, like a limited boost? It, sorry, one, what was the question? Uh, one more time. So, so you mentioned that um, clothes transfer to all your players yep. this year. Yep. Now, does that fall as well as to park events? Like, if you win a park event and you get like a limited boost, does that uh, tie into uh, park uh, event wins transferring between players? Okay. I don't. I don't know that one. Probably yeah. not. But okay, I'm not sure. All right. Cool. This is great because you can ask me a bunch of questions. The community is asking me a bunch of questions. I yeah. will take all these questions, send an email right after this broadcast, <laughs> and then do a broadcast um, uh, either later or pro probably la later this week and get all of those questions uh, clarity on them. Because cool. it, here's, the, here's the struggle. When we release a trailer without a blog, especially one that was released before we were ready, um, it's, you know, all of these questions. There's a lot going on in that trailer. Yeah. So there's a lot of these minutiae details, which we will obviously need to answer, have answered, um, that need to come out. So if you guys are just joining me, first of all, thank you, Mar Mario. I'm annoying to yes, to join us. Um, we're going to talk about next week a little bit in a second, too. But if you guys are just joining, please for um, a, a variety of things, my team cards, Clothing, real life clothing, a lot of stuff. So please drop me a follow. Uh, I appreciate it. Yeah. Uh, another thing I was gonna ask you is that: is there any more trailers for the for the upcoming game? Uh, well, there's always Momentus, right? Mm -hmm. So we'll have Momentus. We still have another feature to announce uh, that I've Ooh. been talking about. Um, nice. So it's. I said this on my broadcast the other day, and you can talk about it however you see fit. But this feature is kind of not based on our launch so like think about park after dark right uh yeah years ago park mm -hmm. after dark we released the trailer after the game came out right yeah you did it was because we didn't do park after dark on the day like park after dark was an event that was in the future this yeah. thing this new feature is sort of like that in that it's not something that will hit the first day but when you see it and when you understand it I think it's going to be something that people play probably as much as any other mode in our game. Nice. So um, we're going to have a little news on that next week. Um, could you give us hints? Like, is it park related, pro am related, or? I think it's, I mean, it's kind of new. It's based on your player, like everything, mostly every new thing in our game outside of okay. my game. So it's based on that a little bit, but it's kind of new. It's something that I don't think people are, are um, I think people will be surprised. Cool. Um, are daily spins back in the game as well for like stage? You know uh, how you used to spin the wheel. So. Yeah, I don't know why uh, cool. it was. Uh, I'm surprised it wasn't in the trailer. Okay. 
Sweet, sweet, sweet. Uh, let's um, see what other what other trailers? There's the TV spot next week. There's the momentous trailer. Um, we always have the 2K countdown. So this last seven days, we always have a bit of news every single day. So that uh, but that starts like Saturday, doesn't it? Um, yeah. Man, we're nine days away. So speaking of which, obviously next week the game drops. Um, where are you gonna be when you have to play it the first time? Like, what, what have you mapped this thing out? Like, um, man. I'm gonna be straight in the park. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as it comes out, I'm going straight to the park. I'm upgrading my player with VC, and I'm going straight to the park. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna be on there all day on the two score. You know, I like the two score. So I'm also gonna try the three v three program as well. I wanna test that out too. So yeah, nice. Somebody just um, asked is uh, somebody just asked some is something back, and I wanted to answer, and now I missed it. You see short, was, short shorts in the trailer? Yes, you do. Yeah. Someone else asked, um, are there any new hairstyles in the full game? Because in the demo... Yeah, I, I put the hairstyles in my note. I, I know that they were limited in the demo, but I think that was on purpose. I imagine there's a lot more hairstyles okay, uh, cool. in, the, in the game. I mean, even last year there was more uh, hairstyles. Um, I, I, I would be very shocked if we pulled any of those out, unless they were just not working for whatever reason. Yeah, and um, someone else asked, is my face going to be scanned in? My, our, we get our face scans next year, right? Yeah. All right, cool, cool, cool. You're talking about your, your yeah. scan from last year? Yeah, 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 my yeah. scan from last year. All right, cool. Yeah. You will have your scan probably, I mean, I'm going to, Constant should have hit you up for your gamer tag on both consoles, and that's why. If he hits you up yeah. about that, that's what he wanted. That's what we're doing. All right, cool. Uh, someone asked, can we put our jersey over our hoodies? Uh, jersey, let me ask about that. Jersey over hoodies. I'll find out. Uh, I also saw that we get to make custom shirts again. The um in the trailer it showed that it said that it was called. I forgot what the feature was actually called, but let me see. I actually wrote it down. There was a feature in there. I think it's called My Style. My Style. That I, yeah, that allows I didn't you. See that My Style. No, My yeah. Style might just be. So we you know we announced those fashion uh, brands that we're working with back at uh, ComplexCon. So there's a yeah. ton more clothing in the game. Um, yeah. but not a customization thing because that created a lot of legal issues. But I'm I'm looking for this my style thing. But I mean we're gonna have so many clothes in there, and it's from all your favorite brands. It should be uh, it should be pretty cool. And you know we're gonna continue to grow that as well. I mean last year we had Don C and Jerry Lorenzo, they're gone. Um, the, you see the spray ground backpack. Yeah. Backpacks. What about backpacks in the game? That's yeah, cool. backpacks in the game. Um, that's very. I'm actually very excited about that. Do you know if we have any, if we can customize those? Like, is there any way possible that we can make like our own design of the backpacks or is it just I, specifically spring? I, uh, I wonder if that's one of the the uh, the rep things. I would not be surprised. Yeah. I mean, here's the thing. As this rep grows, like there are so many more things we can reward now. Um, I mean, since we had park rep in our game a couple years ago, this game has changed so much in terms of what we can prize out and right. you know, how big this thing has gotten. So I would I would not be surprised. Yeah. This Halloween yeah. thing makes me laugh every single time. Yeah. The Halloween thing is nice. And blue glasses, you know, people want to sure. bet back. I mean, like I said, there's a ton more clothing, period. So I would I'd be surprised if there wasn't more funny stuff to, to build on that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, one thing that I also asked, I asked about this um, at the event as well as a report button. Do you guys have any anything to stop like the cheaters and delaying and stuff like that? Oh, uh, reporting. Let me. Uh, note yeah, that down. I've seen that note a couple times, so I'm writing that down. I wish I was on camera so people could see me typing away. <laughs> report. Uh, I can confirm that he's he's right now. His questions to report, <laughs> to report. Oh, you can see me. Uh, no, no. Well, I can see you, yeah, because of Skype. Oh. That's why so I wait, said am I, I think supposed to go Skype on camera. OBS first and then Skype? You know, it's usually just... Yeah, way. I think you are, yeah. Sure, <laughs> or you can fun. just, um, you can deactivate your Skype camera and just activate your camera on the stream. Uh, so if stuff. you, like, if you, like, hide your camera on the Skype yeah. and then go to, um, your OBS and then click Well, the activate problem is I need to do that because it grabs your feed from my other monitor. 
That's how I do it, so unfortunately... I, I, I wonder if I did the order wrong, but anyway, who cares? Everybody knows what I look like. Uh, community able to report um, the layers issue, and uh, ex exploiters. And do backpacks have any features to it, or is it just for looks? Uh, you'll have to see. I mean, we, oh, have, to, we have to give it some <laughs> function, so... All right, cool, cool. 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 Uh, let's see what it's. Can we? You want to hide the rep? What? It, so just so I'm clear, next year you're asking. You want to have the option to hide what rep you are, so, so people don't. Um. Hide from you. That, some some people they kind of hide their rep just to make sure that um it's basically the so opposite people, of leaderboards. People don't yeah. run, run from them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So people don't run from the run from me from the park. You know what's funny? We're doing that for um, VIP influencers. Okay. Because, oh yeah. Because That's the nice. problem is, then you can never get a game with those guys. Yeah. So. What about um? Not even just rep. Even overall, like sometimes people see you're 99 and they don't want to play you, but that doesn't really show in the park. Now that park. This, rep year, is that, back, this but... year there'll be more. You know, well, I don't know about more 99s, but there'll be a lot more 95 pluses, obviously. Yeah. Um. So yeah. I don't think it shows it though when you have rep. Like, right. I think now we're showing rep. I'll look into seeing if um, there's ways to, to hide that stuff. Yeah, because a lot of people, they can't get into games and stuff like that. Someone someone else asked about high rollers. Do you know any information about high rollers or is that like an event as well? I actually wrote that one down already. Um, so the, the question with high rollers is do you get rep from it? Yeah, do you get rep from it? And um, how do, how does jackpot work this year? Is it does it work the same? Where it's based off just luck? Uh, is jack um, based on luck? Okay, I'm writing them all down. I'm gonna all get right, answers cool. to every single one of these questions, and then I'll all do right. a stream. You know, either Thursday, Friday, and uh, oh, so out, someone else asked, "Is Mountain Dew coming back?" Is Mountain Dew coming back? Oh, yeah, the, the, for unlimited boost, basically. The, uh, I don't think it's Mountain Dew because Mountain it's Ruffles, Dew is, right? Isn't a isn't an NBA sponsor anymore? I don't believe. Um, oh. but it could be another partner. It could be another brand. Right, but there is definitely unlimited boost in the game, though. Correct, or a ways that you can earn it. Uh, I'm sure it's based on an event, but unlimited uh, boost from. Event, yeah. I, I won't be able to tell you what event probably, but I can. can I'll, I'll find out if it is associated with some event. Okay, it's cool, cool, cool. So, so again, somebody's asking: Are pie charts fully customizable or preset like the demo? It's somewhere in the middle. Um, there are more pies. There are more archetypes generally, but it's a totally different. UI than user user interface than uh, you guys saw in in the demo. So more to that as we get closer. Can you reset record? Why would you want to reset your record? I mean, I know why you want to reset your record. But why would we want to let you reset your record? They said someone said, "Tell us about the ramen place." Oh, people saw that, huh? <laughs> Maybe you can go get some ramen. No, like I said, I mean, people are saying, oh, it's still a square, blah, blah, blah. The square thing is a good thing. Now, how we build on the square is the thing that's important. Right. And I'm really excited about some of these park rep awards. There's one that I saw today. I'm like, that is going to make people so happy. Um, okay. I'm surprised. And you know what? One of the big notes is, can we follow up with the actual rewards now we won't show everyone by the way somebody yeah. kept, keeps asking uh it does it stop at elite three no there's legend obviously yeah so we we do go beyond elite three yeah and you also said that there's a lot of surprise in the awards as well correct yeah i think people are gonna be really thrilled about that like i said the gr the game itself has grown so much um with things that have happened in the neighborhood and in the in in the park and uh all the other online modes rec and whatnot um so i think that there's just there's a lot more we can reward so i think i think people will be really happy about that someone else asked um 
with the season changing parks, are you allowed to throw snow uh, snowballs? <laughs> we'll have to see. <laughs> and well, someone else also asked about rebirth. That's a good question. You know what rebirth was last year? It was the um at like ninety five overall. It was yeah, basically it was, an award. Ninety three was it? Was, it, it was ninety three right? Uh, um, no, no, no. It was a little bit later. I think it was ninety five. Okay, I, I think, think it's ninety three. Yeah. But oh, it doesn't matter. Whatever. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I, you you were able to re rebirth and then you'd have all your max badges, right? Right. Um, I believe. Well, because it's different this year. I mean, you're not gonna have rebirth at ninety five to get max badges with all the specking i don't think so it wouldn't make any sense do you know what i mean yeah yeah, 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 yeah. um so because you can respect the, the rebirth thing is kind of redundant someone else asked about mask out prices are they still the same like a hundred thousand or uh, i don't know how much they are okay let's see you get to mask up before you worry about that first <laughs> And what I mean, about all the rewards Pro later on are so cool, and by that time, the, the, you know, people complained about how much mascots and stuff cost. If you played right. enough to get to that level, you were probably accruing that a much VC. VC yeah, anyway, that's true. Right, that's true. and yeah, yeah, yeah. and uh, at that point, it was all earned anyway. And the yeah. other thing is, we're saving you a lot of VC because the clothes transfer, mm -hmm. you can respec, you know, so on and so forth. So. Mm -hmm. I think you also save really a lot of happy. VC. Like people that were that were upset about how much VC they spent. Um, I think you, you guys have a lot of reasons to be happy. Hold on, hold on one sec. Let me let me know. Sophie, All you right. need to stop. <laughs> no, High stakes back. Um, oh, he said that there's probably going to be an event like that. There's probably what? There's going to be an event like High Rollers. Yeah, uh, somebody oh. said. Uh, Double yeah. double takeover. I mean, double yeah. all of this now stuff. Wrap. There's, there's no double takeover. Mike Wing already confirmed that. Well, I'm I'm just saying there's going to be there's going to be uh, double rep events for sure. And oh, okay, cool. Things cool. of that nature. nature. See. Any negatives to respec? The only negative that I could think of naturally with respecking, like a lot of games do this, they charge you for respecking. We don't do that, so. Um, I can't think of another what would be a negative. I'm sure somebody will find a negative somewhere, but yeah, I, I can't think of any as of yeah. now. Uh, I, I actually see your, your shoe collection in the background. I was going to ask you about the kicks in uh, NBA 2K20. Are oh, there any, yeah. any new additional kicks this year, yeah, like Yeezys or actually, anything? We actually have a couple slated uh, for early release. Um, uh, I mean, we'll, we'll have some new ones in there from day one and then okay. we'll have um some additional ones like i mean the obvious one was probably greek freak right like yeah we'll, are you uh, able to um customize your sneakers this year well you could do that before yeah yeah, yeah. okay yeah cool. I, I don't see why you wouldn't be able to uh, cool 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 uh what are the questions that we got out uh somebody's asking about quick draw all everything that you guys saw in the demo we uh were looking at that feedback like we have all the data on how many people used a certain badge and how popular that badge was so we're gonna get a pretty good idea and probably make some adjustments to things with all these new badges every time you add a lot of new stuff um you have to kind of see the community feedback and then kind of deal with it yeah. Also, um, one Should more we, thing on the park events. Yes. Do you have to be with your squad and go to the little hoodie thing where you press X again, or does it just change automatically this time? Because you know, with certain events like um, like ruffles, you would have to go to like the very top, and um, yeah, you would have to be with your squad and hit the X button for all three of you guys to enter. Or will it just be a thing where it just changes in the park this year? I, I actually don't know exactly what you're talking about okay so um i like remember the it, event so in, in ruffles you would go yeah we go squad. like like a tunnel yeah it was like a little tunnel you had yeah. to go through but yeah. with reese's reese's would change on its own for a double rep reese's would change on its own yeah like it would was change that because it was private matchmaking because that we that you went through the tunnel um nah not a tunnel oh yeah it was it was matchmaking yeah it was so is it, are those events that's gonna be probably matchmaking? why when you go through a tunnel it's probably matchmaking, matchmaking. yeah is it yeah. going to be matchmaking this year on events as well i think it depends on the event 
Okay. okay. And then there'll be some events that are and some events that weren't. Okay. That cool. aren't. Uh, somebody was asking, can my players wear masks? Uh, that's an interesting question because there are some new uh, gear for your head um, that I think people are going to be super stoked about. And there's one in particular that's going to drop within three weeks of the game being out that I think people are just going to lose their minds over. There's a lot of like new accessories. I think you know, you're going to see crazier outfits in the neighborhood than ever before. Star icon again. Um, we're actually adding more icons um, for to separate influencers. I mean, by the end of the year last year, I don't know if you saw this, Mario, but like there were a lot of like NFL players that were in the game, and they had a star icon. And oh, then there was Quavo, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There was Quavo who had a star icon. And it's like, how do I know the difference between Quavo and some offensive lineman in the NFL, right? So yeah. That's sweet, sweet, sweet. So you guys are gonna have that um, that star like status again? Uh, we will, but we'll also have other other logos. So you guys will see a lot more people that you know out there. Okay, what about VIP this year? Is that a um, is that an award or is that something somebody that's just somebody just court? asked a really good question? Can you is your my court close enough to the park game where you can practice your jump shot? Let me add that one. Sorry, what did you ask, Mario? Um. I actually forgot. <laughs> it's actually a good question. I forgot. It's all right. Um, oh, I was asking about VIP. It was VIP. Yeah. Is VIP a thing for only streamers and YouTubers this year, or is it a thing where people can actually achieve as a rep award? I believe it's one of the higher end rep awards. Okay. It's also cool. uh, available to um, the the uh, some streamers and some celebrity influencers, NBA players, etc. Because let, let's be honest, if Kevin Durant shows up to Rucker, you know, it's not like Kevin Durant's sitting around waiting to play a game. Right? Yeah. You're letting Kevin Durant off of that thing. It's a yeah. lot like it was last year. Like, if I jump onto the neighborhood, I, it's I'm going to be able to, like, get on somebody's spot if I need it. Yeah. But we don't See? give we don't give that to everyone. Obviously, we give it to people who are responsible. Right, right, right. Um, uh, another issue with the VIP actually last year was that some people weren't able to take people off streaks. Is that going to happen this year as well, or do you guys kind of fix that problem? The streaks. Yeah. So basically, um, for instance, I had VIP last year, yeah. and if somebody was on a hundred game win streak, I was able to take them off of it. Yeah. Off the home court. Yeah. Are that, you, yeah. Want, you want to bar it from streaks. Yeah. That's what you're saying. Yeah. I know. That's messed up. I get what yeah. you're saying. <laughs> Is there a way we can restrict that? <laughs> restrict VIPs. Yeah. I'll get on that. Restrict. At least nothing past 10. <laughs> that's funny. I'll, uh, I'll make that note. That's a good call. Um, The rewards for people who hit 99 and 19. Well, now, remember the grind. This is from Gamer Rose. The grind this year is not the 99 anymore. It's the legend and park. So yeah. I imagine that there will be real life rewards for people who hit legend in 20. Um, for people who hit 99 and 19, the first, uh, I think it was like 100, 150, got some shoes and a jersey, I believe. Um, those people will get their. If they haven't got their rewards yet, they're they're probably coming soon. What is the PS4 Pro situation? I don't know what that is. Oh, well, so basically, that was the other thing we talked about—the streak, uh, being able to see streaks while you're in a streak on a streak. Yeah, the PS4 Pro situation. Um, people were saying that there was an issue with frames, with the framework in the neighborhood with um a PS4, and people actually reverted back to the PS4 Slim. Because the game is is less, or the frames work properly on the PS4 Slim yeah, than uh, the Pro. I'll have to PS4 Pro. Um, frame rate. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Someone said, is there going to be any cross-platform playing? Um, 
we want to buy ten. We want my. Well, I, ta- I talked about that before. It's not as simple in our game. It's a, an eventual goal, and maybe you know when consoles shift to the next generation, perhaps, but not for not for two K. Twenty. And who knows when consoles are shift? Hoping next year, or maybe the year after. Well, we shall see. Yeah, I think we I think we pretty much answered almost every question. <laughs> yeah. Um there's other let's see if there's other good questions. Someone asked new tattoos, that's a good one. I'm looking into haircuts and tattoos. Maybe I'll see if I can figure out a, a screenshot to, to put out there. Do you know anything about the VC prices? Um, I believe they're pretty much the same. And again, I mean, the savings is going to come on the fact that you don't have to build a lot of right. new stuff. New and, players, yeah. yeah. And, uh, and in my team, there's a lot more content and even more than last year. So I, th- I think people... If you if you felt fine about VC last year, I think you'll feel better about it this year. Yeah. Do rags? What's the question? I'm sure there'll be do rags at some point. Maybe not first day, but short shorts in rec and pro am. We've heard you, so hopefully that that's something. Um, yeah, somebody asked about Mario asked me earlier about does five v five pro am. Or three v three pro am get park yeah, right. right. I'm gonna get yeah. back to you guys about that. Did they get park rep in um two K? What was it? Two K seventeen. Somebody's asking about suits. Two K seventeen. What about it? Did, uh, 